Hello everyone and welcome, my name is Andrew Cannon, together we can game. In the last episode of Can Play Far Cry 4 Blind, we helped Amita and we were told to go see Long Longinus? In this episode, we have new weapons unlocked, we have the Stormer, we have the Scorpion. So, I actually want to go and buy, and I want to take a look at, you know, some of the other things here. So we have some sidearms, we have other weapons we can get, we have signature weapons, these are going to take a little bit more, we have the ammo, and of course we have maps. Now. I don't know if I'm supposed to have all of these unlocked. I think some of this is because of just me playing. Like I said, I think maybe I have some more stuff because of uh, DLC, but I'll go ahead and try my best not to. I'll just go ahead and get the items. I think that'll be good for now. Um, for sidearms, what do I have? We unlock the scorpion. I feel like this is something I'm actually supposed to have. So I'll go ahead and Put it on my sidearm. Yep. Something new. It says I can customize. What can we do here? Holster. What? Oh, okay. It's just letting me choose to put it there. Uh, paint. I think that'll be fine for now. And with that, let's head and make our way outside. See what we have. We unlocked a lot of areas after doing the bell tower. So there are more new things here. Let's go ahead and take a look at our map. But I actually see we have a skill point that we can use. So... I used this last time, which is focus driving, then we have moving mountains, gadget training might be useful, rhino skin might be useful. I actually think I'm going to go ahead and get, no, I don't have that big of a loot rut sack. I think I'm going to go ahead and get moving target. I need to think more logically. We have moving target now and in crafting, what do we have? Bigger wallet. All right, I'll take that. So just by taking out some of those monkeys, next one we can carry is we're gonna need to peer. So yeah, pretty nice there. So we did get those upgrades, so I wasn't really looking at the map like I probably was supposed to. So, seems that this is a place we can go. So Kyra's refugee, seems like where I actually will head. I can probably take this glider. We did get some of these new points, and then old Isha's house. So because we have some of these newer points, I want to make our way to them. Now, because of the glider and stuff, I want to use those as well. I want to make sure that we're doing a good bit of the stuff that is available to us. Now that we have the grapple, those open up. We can board this. It is very good just to keep making the progress we're going to make here. And as much as I want to make main story progress, if you've seen how I play, you know that I try to balance main story with other stuff. So. That's going to be no different for here. I do like how on the map, though, if you make a waypoint, it seems like that yellow trail will help you find the most optimal way to get there, perhaps. Old E to exit. I still am not perfect on that. Going to need to work on it a little more, but as I'm healing here, I can also... Maybe these are underground. I'm going to assume they are. So while I'm doing that, it would appear... That there is some other stuff that we can interact with. There's some birds running. One of these days I'll learn not to just fall on my face when I'm exploring, but today is not those days. My loot bag is almost full, should have sold that, but as I learned in the last episode, we can spin these things. That's really useful. Two out of 40. Now there's going to be more in here, but I don't exactly know what else we can find. Oh, 250 experience. I'm assuming that's just for exploring. So, as I keep exploring, I'm just going to keep looking. Alright, money and prayer beads. What is this? Kyra's Guidance. My friends, I hear rumors of a planned pilgrimage to Kyra's Guidance Temple high on the cliffs south of the lake. The access to that temple has been cut off for years now, and the path is very dangerous. We can't afford to divert resources away from the Golden Path, because for every lost shrine, I urge you to be satisfied with what you have at Kyra's Refuge. Do not risk injury or worse for one old temple, Amita. I guess Amita is a good point to bring up. I know just by asking in the last episode, some of you like her, some of you don't. You think she's a... Uh, interesting character and you said as I play I'll see more so I do appreciate you guys letting you know who are you are you just a random person here at the temple or do I need to worry about you probably just random person so 
With that, we were able to make our way to it. But it seems... This is where it wants me to go. Asian Rhino. This is the tower I went to. Can we actually fast travel to any of these? Not really. And this is the Golden Pass supplies where I can get award and money, propaganda poster. That's actually very useful to know. I actually like how much it does give me just off the bat. And there's the farm. I guess we can go ahead and make our way to Longinus. Longinus? Since that is kind of what it wants me to do. All the while, though. There might be many hunting opportunities as we keep walking. It's going to be a good balance opportunity for me. Because, you know, every game, as I explore, you get an opportunity. Look at the lighting, though. Lighting looks great. I will say graphically, I mean, most of the time I tend to play older games. So when I get a chance to see, you know, mo more modern stuff, <laughs> I always am like, ooh, pretty. Uh, but there's a question mark here, and I think that's going to be intriguing for me. Oh boy. I feel like the rhino is not going to be that simple to take out with my bow here. Oh boy. Someone might be like, Andrew, just, just leave it alone. And you know, for that, I might just listen for once to someone who might say, I don't think a bow and arrow for someone of my skill level is going to be worth it for my version of Ajay. So, while my loot ref sack is almost full, yep, thank you for letting me know. So much more down here, though. Okay, well, we're going to go look anyway. Hopefully, it's just going to do what it does, where it's not going to matter too much that my loot ref sack is full, but watch this be that one exception. Ooh, Yalung's Ma, location discovered. A lot of firing. Search. Search, white leaf. A lot of stuff here. Prayer wheel, take money, take money. Okay, yeah, so it does work in that way. Where at least I can do this. So yeah, just by exploring, we always have a lot of fun. Okay, I'm assuming it's just gonna be at the bottom down here. There it is. Take the money, I know it's full. I'm assuming if you do both, you can maybe earn a little bit more than just doing one or the other. You're monkeys, it sounds like. And a lot of fighting. So, I'm just going to make my way to our objective and not worry too much on that. Of course, getting an opportunity just to talk with you all. I like Amito for what she is. I think she is in a really weird spot. Okay, seems like we're going to be into a conflict. I could see that happening. Go ahead and get out my sidearm. But I think for where she's at, you know, she's clearly was not expecting company. They are in a civil war, so that's hard. And she's clearly raising kids. So I understand her frustration. Maybe as we go on, I'll be like, you know what? Amita is a jerk. But right now, I definitely see where she's coming from. I don't think it is her fault. I think obviously, you know, war is hard on anyone. I do see the church and I see some monkeys. I hear a lot of gunfire. I like how I actually, since my loot rut sack is full, probably wait just a bit. Let's go ahead and interact. Welcome. I am Longinus. And you, you are AJ. Welcome to my church, away from church. That sells guns? Of course. Well, the meek shall inherit the earth, my friend. All they need are some good guns. Revelation 5.5. 5. It is the most invigorating weed. And one of the elders saith unto me, Weep not. Behold the lion of the tribe of Judah, the root of of David has prevailed to open the book and loose the seven seals thereof. Uh, it is I... our savior. It is our savior returned to us as a lion, a warrior. So I started thinking to myself, 
when the son of God is reborn, what gun would he use? When Christ returns to break the seven seals and bring about the rapture, he returns as a lion, yes? A lion needs teeth. What gun would Jesus choose? Deuteronomy 3247? For there are no empty words for you, but your very life. Or maybe... Revelations 1911. The discretion of a man deferreth his anger. I don't know what you're talking about. A soldier knows. A soldier always knows. For we have seen the rapture and survived it. You need guns to do righteous work, AJ. For every gun is a Bible. For every bullet, a sermon. And for every radio tower that you free from pagans' lies, I will give you something. A reward. It is the will of God. Here. This is for the first one. Vanaport is under attack! We need fighters here Sabah, now! What's happening? We're under attack! Stay away! Oh, shit! Go forth into all the world and proclaim the gospel to the whole of creation! Wow, what an interesting sequence. What gun would Jesus prove? We are timed, though, so I'm not going to waste too much time. Uh, sorry for lack of transparency there. But I do think that was an interesting thing. We also can shoot now. So maybe this is when auto drive can come in. Auto drive on, yes. So this is where it will let you shoot as it is driving for you, although it seems auto drive is slow. Your mother and I, with you on her ship, oh, those were the days. She was never happier than she was back then, and I should say the same for myself. We had such plans, not just for our little family, but for Kirat. It wasn't always like this. I long for those days, but then it's too late. I tried, I really, really did, but this place is ruinous. Try not to let them drag you down, Andre. Ishwari didn't send you back here for that. Interesting. I like Longinus to go back to that. I like what he's saying about our mom. She wouldn't have sent us back there for that. I like how he gave us the gun. I accidentally chose it. But this auto drive feature is pretty much everything I wanted in uh, the first one. So yeah, the fact it can drive for me, fantastic. I also wanna know, what gun do you think Jesus would have chosen? I love that question, but I'm curious. I think Jesus would have uh, chosen probably something sleek something that would not inspire too much fear but would only be used to protection i do think it'd probably just be a sidearm although jesus was a carpenter oh boy i think this is a good time to exit this is our time to go back to the sidearm we have clear the village of army soldiers keep your head down and save whoever you can i'm not far i'll be there soon with help all right I like how we actually have the one gun he would have given us anyway, him being Longinus. So that's act ooh, helicopter, that's gonna be gonna be interesting. Headshot. Western Devil. So on the bright side. I know this looks dire here. We can still do a lot to help. I know that just us being there, Pagan's probably not going to be the nicest to us. That is something we're going to need to keep in mind. Oh boy. Not the time to run out. Nice. Okay, let's heal, let's heal, let's heal. Oh boy. I'm gonna switch. I think I'm gonna have to. Instead of hiding, come on, how do I? Okay, shotgun just seems like it'd be the better of the two for me right now. Gosh, the screams are terrifying, but ultimately, 
it is a weird situation to be in because, you know, this is completely brought on by AJ being here. We're here to help try to save the people, but I don't know how much people we're saving. Oh boy. Yep, <laughs> that, that's about right. All right, we are back to about where I was earlier. Ooh. I actually think instead of that... Oh, sorry, sorry. Didn't mean to kill you. So let's heal, fire. Maybe I should have chosen that Rhino skin perk. I'm learning as I play. Fire is uh, pretty prevalent thus far. There's that, you only have a shotgun. I have a little bit more range. Maybe that, maybe that will be what helps here. Oh my God. Thankfully, I have so many syringes, but... Oh man, they are unlimited. You scared the crap out of me. He is on fire though. I should take him out, right? See what happens. I hear the uh, creature coming, the predator. Oh, a note. Mask of <laughs> Lung, we are still searching for whoever is responsible for a recent spate of murders. In the meantime, all Golden Path members are instructed to remove or destroy any masks of the Demon Yell Lung found around the murder sites. They are bad omen and should not be left in place. Could you imagine? He's like, all right, I need your help, Ajay. Save the village. Ajay's like, but there's reading I can do. There's that. There's that. Is there more down here? Oh boy, yes there is. And then there's you. I thought I took you out. Apparently I did not. Come on, come on. Really? Ah, so close. I think it's saved right where I need to be. I'm assuming it says defeat the reinforcements. So I'm assuming I made, I did what I was supposed to do. So I'm gonna say that was the win on our part. Oh, another letter. My house of prayer. Even them I will bring to my holy mountain and make them joyful in my house of prayer. Their burnt offerings and their sacrifices shall be accepted upon my altar. For mine house shall be called a house of prayer for all people. My doors are always open and all Lord's children are welcome to visit me at the Golden Path Training Camp. Lunginous. Well, considering that's what started this whole thing was speaking to you. Oh boy. Are we going to have to take out the helicopter? Feels like it. Yeah, that's the only thing I could see that has the reinforcements coming in. Can we even? We aren't soldiers at all, man. Ajay's just getting a bad deal here. And this whole town's just got a really bad deal. Take down. Luckily, you can still take them down relatively easy. At this point, my tactic is just kind of... Oh boy. Is heal when I can. And oh boy. Poor AJ. Talk about getting thrown right into this. So I feel that as we keep playing... I'm going to find a style that works for me right now. This is sloppy. I'm very aware of that, but I guess I wasn't expecting it. And that is kind of one of the things it talks about. So much fire. Oh boy. We're going to need to save uh, Mita's daughter, sister, headshot. I, I know there's skills. Oh. No, 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 no. Why? Every time. <laughs> you can take them out before they get to you. Let's go save the daughter, the sister. We'll find out. There is an upward path. I feel like that would be useful. 
Get away from me. This is the window I'm going in. Madra, where are you? Madra, are you down here? Yes. People need to see her. It'll comfort them. She's just a child, Sabal, and she's terrified. I'll take her home, and then we'll worry about the people, okay? Thank you. You're okay. <laughs> this is what we get for rescuing Ajay. We hit Paul's house, he slaughters her village. This isn't on Ajay, it's on me. I can't worry about that now. They took the outpost, and they have hostages. Fine. The outpost first. Without it, we're cut off from the others. Come. Return to sender. Mission complete. Man, a lot happened there, you know? She had to watch her village get destroyed. I get why she doesn't necessarily like us. We're not really doing that much that proves to her that we're good. So King Min's Kairat can be found in the collection menu and is updated as you meet people, discover locations, and animals. Brother, we need to talk. Sabal, what is it? I'm needed in Banapur. An emitter is focused on the outpost. So it's up to you to help with the hostages. I know it's a lot to ask, but they must be rescued before we take back the outpost. But Amita said that... The outpost is important, but our top priority should be the lives of those hostages. The people of Kirat depend on the Golden Path for protection. We cannot let them down. Rescue the hostages, brother. So we have two different things we can do. I want to go look at skills, and I want to go ahead and get Rhino skin. It seems like that might be useful, especially later on. Uh, healing syringe level two might also be worth it, but I don't have four yet. Forceful strength, gain an additional health slot. Might be worth starting to save some of these. Elephant rider, hold E to ride elephants. That'll be fun later on. Um, but for now, rhino skin would have been very useful in that last mission. I think it'll be useful going forward, so I'm gonna go ahead and put it there. I don't think I have anything new for crafting. No, I don't. But I have a full full loot sack, so that's what I wanted to try to focus on. But yeah, just that entire sequence where I get why she thinks AJ is a bad omen. I mean, I was part it cannot be the end of Bonapur. It cannot be. We'll rebuild. Fagan won't defeat us this easily. Can't search. Can you imagine they're having this heartful moment? Ajay's like, hey, if you could just don't mind me, I just want to search your dead body. But I do think it's actually a really touching moment. It's very rare after an event like that in a game where you see kind of how the town or whatever was attacked is reacting. I mean, this is pretty sad. In both parts, like they're clearly defeated. There's just bodies in the street. I think this is actually a very touching moment. I don't, can't recall a lot of games that show you kind of the effects in the aftermath. Like these people are clearly distraught and as they should be. Gosh, the just this alone is so sad, but really powerful in showing what is happening to these people. Really enjoy that attention to detail. Right now, I'm going to go ahead and quick sell, sell everything I don't need. That's perfect. Now with that, we have more money. I will go ahead and just refill, buy and customize, get body armor, you know, buy syringes. So I don't seem to have any of this, but that's fine. Sidearms, you know, we have this. We have a lot of money, but I don't know if that's what I should be focusing on. I want to get another map. I might as well buy the south items, I guess. So I'll buy the map and then I will buy the locations just cause it seems to be all in the south. I don't know what has unlocked the others. So that is something I'll keep in mind. Money's down a little bit, but it is what it is. If we go here, Scorpion is fine. The Mark four is fine. I might need to actually buy a real weapon. We have the AK 47 that we found. There's some other weapons here that we can get later. Can't really do much else here, so I think that's going to be it for the weapon types. 
But yeah, it is, it is a really sombering moment to be able to see how the people here are reacting to what happened to them. I mean, they were, by all intents and purposes, just ravaged, and it's super sad. And it shows that all actions we have will have consequences. We knew that, but it's one thing to know, it's another thing to see it. What have they done to my home? Like, you can hear the, the pain in the voice acting. They, they really didn't have to do this, but the fact that they did says so much just for this game. Now, looking here, we have some more masks. We have a lot here. So, outpost with one alarm. Seems regular to what I'm aware. Unknown location we can discover right near Bonapur. And if we zoom out, you know, we're starting to see just how big this game is going to be. I'm assuming this is everything that we can do, but our next location is going to be there. I just really am appreciating this game for what it is. I actually think I want to check out this unknown location. All the while, I just want to really take in what we're getting to see here. And again, I like that we're getting a little bit of action and consequences. So for that, I think this game is really elevating itself higher than I thought it would be. Not saying I didn't think it'd be as high, but I'm just saying like, wow, they didn't have to do this. They didn't have to show the more human side. And for that, I'm very impressed. And I see why a lot of you are saying Far Cry 4 changes so much to the standard formula. Now, I think the reason that this isn't working the way I want it to is because it's saying this is our objective. So I guess I'm just going to keep following the question mark, even though the thing there isn't following exactly as I want. But I'm very impressed with everything being displayed and shown so far in Far Cry 4 from the graphics to the characters already. Like just in that moment, we heard pagan men talk to us on the radio. We hear, we hear a, more and more his ideas and thoughts. Even if we don't agree with them, we at least get to hear them. And I think that in itself is really cool. So we have a shack discovered. Interesting that it gives us this little blue icon here. Leaving mission zone. Oh. Really? I, I didn't realize that was a thing. Your wait is over. How long have you been in the deep? How long have you been trampled by Kyra and her hideous lotus children? No longer, my lord, my love, no longer. The goat. So, return or the mission will fail. So it seems like this isn't really an optional thing. But how far can I go? I, I mean, I'm not trying to fail the mission here. But there was something on the map I wanted to see, and you know. So we're in a hut. Let's try to find this mask somewhere here. Maybe for these, you actually have to search more. Ah, there it is. Found the mask. So, let's hold to E to interact. Mask of Yelung removed. Two for our next reward. I just want whatever is in here. Hold E to search. All right. Guns for Hire Token 3. Botanmir. I'm assuming that's what's there. So, we discovered that location, and in the next episode, I guess we're going to go save those hostages. Let me know, what do you think about pagan men attacking the compound? The thoughts of getting to see the destruction, the aftermath of it. And of course, what gun do you think Jesus would have used? And here's what you have to say. Thank you all so much for watching. Thank you all so much for your time. I'm Andrew Can. Together we can game. And I hope you have a great day.